Okay, so we're making this recording because it has come to our attention that many people have been purchasing counterfeit units from authorized resellers on the internet. In this video, we want to teach you how to identify a counterfeit copy. Now, we want to um, you know, preface it by saying that you know, this, this video is made in fair use and it's for the purposes of criticism, news reporting, and teaching, which does not infringe anybody's copyright. So uh, with that, I'd like to begin. You know, um, it's, it's, a, it's quite a shame when you find a lot of people uh, doing counterfeit out there. And especially when we have a, a company out there that is doing it uh, without any shame. And uh, they're pretty upset because, you know, they've they been getting away for a very long time and nobody's been really challenging them on the software out there. Now, my company owns the copyright. We own the source code and uh, we own the trademark. Now, since the recording of this video, they've um, sneakily gone out and uh, tried to make some counterfeit trademarks of their own. Uh, but nonetheless, we want to make sure that you're protected. And so we have a promise to you. If you've purchased uh, Biophilia through PayPal or any credit card and you do get a, a refund, from them. All you have to do is show us that you got a, a, a proof of refund from PayPal or from your credit card company and we'll give you a full licensed copy of the original 2016 software that Singularity stole from our company. Now um, they, they actually most likely stole it from a dealer and I'll show you that evidence uh, soon but uh, you know due to worldwide counterfeiting of the Vector NLS software we have to report, you know, what are the software out there that are that are actually infringing on our copyright. So due to the theft of our software, we've had to enforce our software copyrights worldwide. So we have our we have our software copyrighted in Russia and we have our software copyrighted in the United States and we're expanding that worldwide and we have several trademarks um, as well worldwide. While the brand name Vector has been used since before 2010, you can look at our trademark. The name Vector and similar de devices are one of the most counterfeit devices on the market. Moreover, counterfeit Vector devices are now made in China and in Hong Kong of very low quality. Most consumers are not aware that these devices were originally hack copies from our branch in Russia. So our branch in Russia still exists today and we still partner in with them, but we've obtained full rights from, from them uh, for, for the trademark, for the copyright, and for the and for the, the trademark. Due to China's hacking of the software, the counterfeit NLS is vulnerable to injection of viruses, ransomware, and spyware. And so we want to make sure that everybody is aware of this, that because they don't have the source code, all they're doing really is injecting the, the program um, with their you know malicious code and with their pictures and so forth. And uh, they're trying to you know make it make it as if it's their software, which is not true. And so this, this allows the manufacturer to view into your computer at any time. If they were to put something or if they didn't like something, they can blacklist your device or, com uh, or completely make it unusable and force you to keep on upgrading and, and purchasing you know, more things from them. Um, and also they're, they're selling all these weird add-ons that they don't know anything about. And unfortunately, most of these counterfeiters are targeting uh, people who want to buy at a low price uh, many in Latin American countries, um, Africa and Europe, uh, we see that as the biggest problem. Now, if you have it installed um, and you want to see if you have a counterfeit copy, you can just go to the go to the directory. You know, you go to the directory of where it gets installed, and you'll see that they stole this over on. What they've done is they've got the executable. And they uh, just created an icon over it. I'm not sure. Probably today, maybe they've um, injected the program with their icon. But this is how we found it. You know, we did an inspection. And if you look at if you look at the configuration file, you see that um, they took it from a dealer that was uh, from Washington. Uh, originally, they they used to be uh, a vector dealer, and they no longer are. And they too are creating their own. Uh, uh, fake version of a software which will create a separate video on that as well and and you know one of their biggest uh, partners in uh, in Europe is this company called ISHA and they're in the in the Netherlands and these guys are pretty nasty 
they've created a couple of slander websites, you know, against uh, against my company, and they just put vile, filthy um, slander out there. I mean, these guys are just terrible. So they they registered my my trademark names as domain names, and they set up some um, bulletin board, and they put nothing but lies on there. But you know, the funny thing is that uh, prior to me coming in, they were touting Vector as one of the best softwares out there. And they say that our Vector software is the best and most complete NLS software that they have ever seen. That's, that's a quote from their website. And, um, and so the reality is that there is no honor among thieves, right? So these guys, these guys are greedy. Um, they're working with this uh, company in China and uh, so if you get a if you get a refund um, from them as well, we'll we'll honor the same from them. And I'll show you a little bit of how how um, how this biophilia has stolen our designs, right? To to kind of make it look like that their stuff. So this is the original um, image of our BioStar NLS. We've had this for quite some time. So they saw this, and you could see in the background that they they copied our design. You know, so they can put, make it look professional. I mean, they're not even original themselves. They're stealing stuff from us. And then if you look at this, if you look at this device that they've created, they're actually fooling you guys. See, they put this little, little handheld thing. And I'm going to tell you, it does absolutely nothing. That including their, um, their black box, that does nothing either. Because, you know, we have the source code. And I can tell you that none of this, um, all these little fancy things that they put on to to fool you, uh, do any of the, those type of things. So they're really creating, you know, they're really creating, um, you know, the illusion that they they own it. And unfortunately, the consumers are the ones that are are being taken advantage of, right? So this is our 2016 software, and you can see that we have a little um, Android picture, and they've kind of created the same thing as well too. Um, so they're just they're just looking at our website and they're copying everything, you know. And and so anytime you purchase counterfeit software, you're really um, doing a disservice not only to your business but to anybody anybody that uh, that you are are working on. I mean, it's it's terrible for for energetically, karmically, and everything. So we sent them, and and I'll show you. So we sent them a cease and desist warning letter. Now these guys are hiding out in Hong Kong or where they're at. In China and you know China doesn't respect anything uh, they don't respect the rules they don't respect people's intellectual property these guys are, this especially singularity is just completely ripping off uh, everyone you know they produce nothing they made nothing they didn't buy anything but and they stole stuff and put their brand you know, their name on it so we sent them this letter you can see my signature there um, you can see at the bottom of this letter my three companies um, uh, the, the two companies that we re represent, Biosar Technology International, Biosar Technology SRO, and Vector Limited in Russia. And um, we told them that we understand. So we, we came at them very nice. We said, hey, look, to prevent, um, to prevent confusion on the market, you know, we're asking you, we're letting you know that we're the owners of the software, we're owners of the trademarks, and to uh, stop selling um, our, our counterfeit software. And so they replied back right away. You know, it was nice in the beginning. Uh, here's an email. So this is, you could see this is our email box from, from Gmail. And um, this is uh, this guy, Ken, which is not even really his name. It's a, his name is like Jing Ro, uh, something like that. Uh, you, you, you can tell because if you purchase from PayPal, it's not even his company name that it's going to. This, this fake uh, singularity company that uh, supposedly uh, exists in China, but you know, not really any, anywhere in PayPal do I see the word singularity. So this is also probably a fake uh, company. But anyway, he replies back and he says, Dear friend, thank you for your email. We do not, we do not know Biophilia software is from your company. We are one imported from other Russian companies. So look at here, they're even admitting that Biophilia is not even their software. They're telling me in this email that they're getting, that supposedly they got biophilia from another Russian company, which is a complete lie. And, and he says, in order not to affect your business, which is my business, we remove biophilia from our website. And he also told his distributors to remove it. So, so I confirmed. I could reply back and I said, yes, I confirmed. And he says, I've deleted biophilia with my sincerity. We hope we can get along peacefully and not embarrass our small company waiting for reply. 
So this is kind of like his his stall tactic, um, and then eventually he just you know went by his ways because he he felt that he's protected inside of uh, China and you know there's no reach out to him. Which in a sense is true because uh, Chinese Chinese government is communist co country and they protect their own people, um, and that's what you get for communism. You know you you really don't you really have just a, a rogue country doing whatever it is that they want. But nonetheless, you you guys have a choice whether you're gonna purchase from some from some company like this that's that's basically tricking you. Um, I've shown you the proof there. We can go over our trademarks on another web page. You can look at our trademarks and our, um, we'll go over all that. But nonetheless, it's it's illegal to buy counterfeit goods. Okay, so uh, you, you you know now that that biophilia and all the products, NLS products that is sold by Singularity is complete fraud. So if you're not sure, they have uh, this bioplasm, that's complete fake. That's actually, that's older than NLS. This is like the the most oldest software there is um, that was originally stolen. Um, and they're, you know, whatever they're selling it to, it's not worth it. You know, one day, if you, one day we're going to include it as part of the bundle. So that if you want this this old version of uh, a vector, which is basically uh, ten years old, you know, definitely you guys can you can have at it if you if you really want it. But I'll tell you, um, this is a company here. He goes by a lot of different names. Um, he has a lot of different uh, people working for him. So I would just I would just um, you know ask you to do what's right um, and not getting involved with counterfeit software. Okay.